changing a database up from under a service that's as well used as Kindred is quite an undertaking. It's like changing out the engine of a car while it's still going 80 miles an hour on the freeway. Right? So it has to be done carefully and it has to be done correctly. It enables us to be regulatory compliant in different geographies worldwide. There's no corresponding database system with similar properties today. Not an open source market and not even as a cloud service. It really has unique features and capabilities that is a perfect fit for our highly regulated markets. In 2016, when I traveled to Sweden to meet with the Univet team at the time, now Kindred, the problems that they were facing were not going to be met by Cockroach 1.0, which only provided geo-replication. At that point in time, geo-partitioning was really just something on the drawing board. It was an idea, but uh, an idea that didn't have uh, enough form to really make into a uh, final product. After talking with Kindred about the possibility of geopartitioning, it became clear that uh, it would be a great fit for the problems that they were trying to solve in building a service that spanned the EU and Australia. So what is CockroachDB? Uh, CockroachDB is an open source distributed SQL database. It's a database that has no single points of failures and it's designed from the ground up to support building massive and extremely reliable cloud applications. The goal with CockroachDB 2.0 was to figure out how do we create um, a high performance database that can help your team adapt as they grow and as they encounter new types of challenges. So geopartitioning is a capability that allows the database to store data in close proximity to the user. So this is crucial if you want to lower latency and you have users, for example, all over the globe. Uh, it also allows the data to be domiciled in the same jurisdiction as the user. So this is becoming increasingly important with data privacy regulations. Working with Kindred has been surprisingly seamless. Uh, you would think that with the time difference, there would be a lot of trouble communicating, but you know, with modern tools and with open source, it's actually been fairly straightforward. Our collaboration with Cockroach Labs has been terrific. They are phenomenal team of uh, engineers with a long experience coming from various backgrounds dealing with large distributed systems. Well, I believe the collaboration between Kindred and Cockroach Labs has really just gotten started. I'm extremely excited about uh, what we've built and when I think about what we can build in the next two years, I really think the sky's the limit.